Okay, let's import the 3D model into AlphaCam and using the drag and drop method let's import the p6 3D rough file and okay okay now let's create a work volume from the solid model utility select command create bounding work volume and now let's check the height of this work volume from the cat tab select report coordinates command and using this snap select this point and in the z-axis the value is more than minus 95 millimeters and now let's assume that we have a 100 millimeters thick stock so we have to edit this work volume a little and from the 3d tab select the set work volume command select this work volume and as bottom z enter minus 100 and click ok and now we assume that we want to have machining allowance at the top of the part so we will move our part down gently from the edit tab select move command select 3d model and accept the selection to pick a base point use endpoint of snap and select the bottom of the 3d model okay and this point move to the new position let's select this snap and select this point as a new position okay now the bottom wall of the model is at the bottom of the stock okay let's cancel this command and let's set the material from 3d tab select set materials select the work volume geometry and as material bottom z enter minus 100 click ok cancel this command and save our project in alphacam training folder as the p6 3d graphic okay having such a design prepared we can proceed to free axis machining.